PitFirstBoxing.com. We got the one and only Dante Strayhorn. I mean, fourth win. Amazing one right there, though. I mean, stoppage in the fourth round. I mean, you got your trainer right here, Gerald. Gerald, get in here. Yeah. I mean, as we know, I think it was in August, if I remember, that's about a good, what, five months ago. Got a little, little incident, my man, in the rain, though, man. Took you off track. I mean, I was out in Vegas. I seen you training hard with your cast on your arm, though. I mean, you know, hard work, as they say, dedication. You didn't stop. Kept on doing it. Now you back, man. How was the whole training camp? Man, training camp was always, always hard work. But it was, it was a great training camp. I had fun. GT pushed to the limit. When I started getting lazy, he pushed me. He stayed on top of me. We trained real hard to make 35. So we just start waiting from now on until, until we want to move up, move back up. I mean, once you got that cast off, man, I mean, you know, you went right in, put your gloves on, went fighting. Yeah, it took some time, you know, I had to knock the rust off, you know, for, for months due to inactivity. But, uh, I mean, I, I didn't feel that rust in there, and, I, I'm, and I'm happy about that. I mean, some things I could have done better, but, you know, that, that's part of the game. You learn it in each fight. No doubt. Now, Gerald, now today, what were the pluses and minuses that you take out of his, you know, show tonight? Pluses was, uh, first of all, this is supposed to be a six-round fight, right? So, me looking at the fighter, I got to see a little bit of, I was going to take me like 15 seconds to look at a fighter and I'd be able to break it down, you know what I'm saying, for the fight. And uh, so we was going to take him into like second round, maybe third round before we get him out. And um, after the third round, they said, uh, le last and final round, I'm like, what? I'm signing our name on the contract for the uh, six rounds, you know what I'm saying? So I said, hey, it's the last round, you got to get him out of there. He went there and did it. But um, plus it was... Uh, no rush. You can't tell he was. You can't tell he just came up broke, breaking his wrist. You know what I'm saying? And um, we worked hard. We worked on everything. You know what I'm saying? Before the cast came up, and then when the cast came up, we worked on everything even more. So um, whole bunch, no rush. Some positives and uh, minuses. Well, no minuses. Well, no minuses at all. I think it's one of them fights. You know, you don't have to have no minuses out there. That's the best thing. I mean, one of them fights. I mean, when he took the cast off, man, when was when he started sparring already? You know, how long until? Uh, since the cast came off, I made him take a little bit off. No sick you gotta let that shit heal. Yeah. Yeah. If, you, if you get your hands up, even if you ain't throwing it hard, somebody could, you know, you could catch a punch, that shit could fuck your wrist back up. So I wait until, you know, it's safe to wait by paper. It's a wait let's go, let's go, showtime, baby, let's go, let's go. Nice. Look, let's go, let's go, showtime. Yeah, we waited six weeks. We got back in there and we sparred with top caliber, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Oh, Kareem Mayfield, and Diego Magdaleno, Jesse Magdaleno, you name them, you boxing, you know what I'm saying? Dante, as we know, 2013, you know, you came in with your pro debut and everything. You came in hard. 2014 is right around the corner. I mean, any opponents out there that you want to step in with? Uh, I mean, it, right now, I'm not, I'm not calling nobody out. I'm, I'm just rebuilding myself and moving up. But as, but as I get up, I will be, you know, calling up on the yeah, Little by little, as I say, step yeah, by step. Little by little. I'm, I'm here it. to get these belts, man. And, and one more thing, 2013 was just a learning experience. 2014, that's going to be a big year for me, man. Televised fights, all that. No doubt, man. Couple one more thing, I'm going to dedicate this fight to, to, to my Yeah, I've seen that, man. He was gunned down in Cincinnati. 2008. Sad, man. A lot of our homies, man. We lose a lot of our peoples, though, man. So, a couple last words for your fans, worldwide, family, and everything. Uh, just, just keep supporting me, man. It's, it's going to happen. It's going to take some time. It's going to happen. Just stick with me, man. I appreciate it. Love y'all. Always a pleasure, Dante. Keep doing your thing. Peace. Thank